Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for January 6th of 2023. Well, it is titled Moon O'Clock 2022. So what do we see here? Well, here we see images of the 12 full moons of this past year of 2022. And set up here like the face of a clock, we see at one o'clock the wolf moon from January of 2022, working our way all the way around up to 12 as the cold moon on December 7th of 2022. Now, the full moon also occurs tonight, and late this evening the moon will be full. So, actually, if you're looking out at it at any time over the next day or two, it will look very, very close to full. Now, a full moon occurs when the moon is opposite to this in the sky to our sun. And that way it is being fully illuminated and we see the fully illuminated face of our moon facing Earth at that point. At any other portion, we only see part of the lit, lit face of the moon. So like any other object subject to sunlight, the moon is always half illuminated and the phases occur simply because we only see a portion of that illuminated part. We see all of it during the full moon, none of it during the new moon and something in between for the intermediate phases in between that. But here we can see all the different moons and as we go through from the wolf moon in January to the snow moon in February, the worm moon in March, the pink moon in April, the flower moon in May, the strawberry moon in June, the buck moon in July, the sturgeon moon in August, the harvest moon in September, the hunter's moon in October, the beaver moon in November, and the cold moon in December. And of course, we're beginning that cycle again today as we will have the first full moon of this year. Now here we have images taken from Sri Lanka on Earth, of course, and taking a picture of each full moon and then putting it together in this image to show the full moons of the year. Now another thing you can note is that the patterns that we see on the moon are always exactly the same. We are always looking at the same side of the moon as we look from Earth. And if you match up those patterns, you can see sometimes they're turned in different orientations. But the actual pattern of light and dark areas is exactly the same for each moon. And as I said, that's because the moon rotates around Earth with exactly the same speed at which it rotates on its axis. And that means that it will always keep one side pointing towards Earth and we only see half of the moon. And until the late 1950s, we didn't even know what the other side of the moon actually looked like. So that was our picture of the day for January 6th of 2023. It was titled Moon O'Clock 2022. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be stations in space. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone. And I will see you in class.